Hey fam, what's good? See your favorite African brother reporting. So right here we have a leaked audio of Wak 100 talking to the FBI about Jay Prince. Check out this clip and let's discuss about it on the comment section. And that and this and remember that daddy beat a Rico case back in the day. And remember her, you got the recording of when the fans called me a month, two months ago, right? Uh-uh. You never heard oh, that recording? I promise you, I never heard never that. Heard yo, bro, yo, put the... Y'all got her. content for your boy right, today. This is the Who feds calling me, trying to get me to say, Jay Prince has been threatening me. Oh, my goodness. And watch how I handle it. Yeah, here we go. Yes, sir, and James Prince, Sr.? I mean, I don't... I wouldn't have no information other than just me helping with a Larry Hoover project. Okay, yes, sir. Well, that's what I'm kind of uh, wanting to talk to you about. Okay. Well, what's wrong with me working on a Larry Hoover project? No, sir. I, no, nothing's nothing's wrong whatsoever with it. Uh, I'm I'm glad someone is is advocating for him. That that wasn't the issue. Um, I was just um, information has pro been provided that you've had some disagreements with Mr. Prince. Are you familiar with him? Uh, I mean, I know who he is, but I don't have no issues with Mr. Prince. Okay. So, um... I mean, a disagreement is a disagreement. I don't know how that factors in the FBI. Well, I, I think Mr. Mr. Jones, uh, uh, on the YouTube videos going back and forth with him calling you a snitch and you calling him one and, and, and all of, and, and all of that. It's a disagreement. I don't know how that factors in the FBI. Well, I, I think Mr. Mr. Jones uh, uh, on the YouTube videos going back and forth with him calling you Smith and you calling him one and 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 all of and, and all of that would, okay. would be where we received information that there was possibly a disagreement. Yeah, but well, uh, well, even if we did do that, why would why would that be an answer that the FBI? Because these well, ones have had any bearing cases pending against one another. We have never done any business with one another. Um, as far as I know, Mr. Prince uh, uh, is a businessman as, as I am. So even regardless of what we said to each other, um, as far as a snitch and not being a snitch, like why would that be an uh, interest of the FBI? That's what's kind of confusing to me. Okay, no, I can, and I can, I can explain that. I mean, of course, there's nothing wrong wrong with that whatsoever um uh, we're just making sure that uh no threats have been made to you from anyone uh associated with him over over y'all's dispute no i haven't uh no threats have been made uh, nor do i feel threatened uh, you know two men get angry two men say things uh, we both been in each other's presence uh, from time to time um, I know his, I know his children. Uh, no, nah, not at all. I don't feel threatened. Was it something you, you guys know that I don't know? Cause as far as, <laughs> well, as, as, yeah, as, far as I'm concerned, it's just, you know, the, the daily bullshit propaganda that happens on social media. Oh, yes, sir. I understand that. But you, but I think you could, uh, kind of understand that sometimes things go past social media and, um, we were provided information that possibly, possibly that something went beyond that. And so we're just calling to clarify and make sure that you haven't been threatened or, or anyone that you know that have been threatened by him or his associates regarding the disputes that you've had over social media, over YouTube, over Instagram, and, and all of that. No, Mr. Prince has an issue any press towards me. Um, I don't feel threatened. Um, uh, I've said to him the same things he said to me, and that's just two men saying things. Uh, I don't think it's that serious of a situation. As far as I know, Mr. Prince has uh, continued his business, he's a pillar in his community, as I am. I don't even understand. Like I said, I don't know what you guys have going on or what you guys heard. That's above my, you know, my reach. But he personally, no, I haven't got any threats, nor do I feel threatened by the man. Okay, so are y'all working together on the Free Larry Hoover project? Uh, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. 
it's not my the ownership of the project is not mine. It belongs to somebody else. I'm okay. just assisting that individual. No, uh, I, but I did I did put the uh, attorneys in contact with their with their family attorney. So at this point, uh, it's not even a conversation between me and Jay Prince. It's a conversation between the individual who owns the content on my side, attorney, and their uh, the Hoover family attorney. So it's you know for the last month or so you haven't heard uh, me or Mr. Prince. Uh, say really anything to each other because there's no need to. Okay, understandable. Mr. Jones, was there ever, I know there was a, um, a I don't know, She did she record an interview? I, I don't have her name uh, present, but she's out of LA um, and, and she recorded a video with Mr. Hoover at one time. Are you, are you familiar with that? Uh, somebody recording a video with Mr. Hoover? Or an interview. She conducted an interview. Oh, yeah. We have five hours of interview. Yes, sir. And yes, at any yes. point... Okay, and it was a female, correct? I don't have her name with me at this exact moment. Yeah, exactly. It's an it's a, it's a elderly woman that owns it. Yes, yes, sir. And, and let me ask you this. Have, have you ever heard of any information that uh, Mr. Prince or his associate has... Um, I tried to request that information, the, the video from her. Oh no! Well, I was in the, I, I mean, I'm the one that alerted him that the uh, footage was was real and tried to merge a deal um, with them because they own the life rights. This is the rights of a regular uh, documentary that I was recording while he was in prison. So <clears throat> I just tried to bring the two parties together. Um, to see if they can do one, do a make it one big situation. So yes, sir. And so, who owns the rights to that? To that the, the the lady that the lady who has the footage, she has the contract. I have the contract. I forward the contract to the family attorney. Um, um, she she's been on it since nineteen ninety eight. Yes, sir. And did Mister Prince attempt to get the rights to that interview? Oh uh, no. Attempted to negotiate a deal if possible. The negotiations are still going on. But I okay. think that's just really nothing wrong with the negotiating. Oh, absolutely not. I'm, I'm not implying that whatsoever. Just some information that we received was that um that uh the, the documentary the the businesswoman didn't want to really give up the documentary and uh possibly could have been pressured to do so. No, no, I don't. I don't know anything about her being pressured. Um, she had a conversation on my phone. It was just a simple business conversation. Um, when you do a business, that's always offered. You know, either you're going to accept the offer or you're going to continue to negotiate. So, as of right now, but still negotiating. She's she negotiating. It's just the two attorneys are talking and they're figuring it out. Other okay. Than that, it's, it's, um, you know. Uh, Mr. Uh, Prince has been a close friend to uh, the Hoover family. He's done a lot of business. I've seen a lot of business. So the man is well in his right to attempt to negotiate. But that's all it was, was negotiations. No more, no less. Okay. Well, I I appreciate your time. Thank you so much for talking to me. Um, if you want to keep my number and anything uh, comes up or you... Or you hear of anything dealing with any type of threat or, or anything like that, um, I would appreciate if you could give me a call. Um, you know, as long as things are. I don't know why the threat thing keeps coming up. Like, I don't, why is that, where is that coming from? Well, I, I mean, I think, you know, when it's on social media, you know, YouTube and, you know, court, court records come out, uh, you know, things are said, uh, Comments are made, um, information is received to the FBI, and so we just have to follow up. And so I, I just thought I would talk to you directly instead of, you know, yeah. just to... These things are all in funny games. You know, a lot of times we play the media because we got events coming up. We got artists and things coming up. You know what I mean? So, you know, kind of like that social media is not all real. A lot of it is fiction. Those lot of it is you know, uh, it's pretty thought out uh, to put some attention on something we want to look at, but 
Uh, me and Mr. Prince, we're good. Um, the lady who has the footage, she's good. The attorneys are talking. Um, I can forward you my counsel's number. His name is Alex Kessel. If you want to get a hold of me, you can call him. And then uh, we can take it from there. But other than that, yeah, there's no problems on this side. I, I, would, I would hope to believe there's no problems on Mr. Prince's side. Yes, sir. No, and and I'm not saying that there is. We're just we're just following up. Um, I mean, y'all y'all two are both well known individuals, uh, pillars in your community, like you said. Um, but I think you can also understand our point of view that you know some sometimes and um, sometimes people in general uh, kind of take one side or the other, and, and they take it a little bit too far. And I'm not saying Mr. Prince has taken anything too far. I'm not saying you have taken anything too too far. Just as you know, when it becomes publicized, other people can take it a little bit too far. So I, I was just calling to make sure that everything was good, that you're safe, that you don't you don't feel threatened in any way, Not that, at all. and everything was good. Not at all. Not at all. Great. Well, yeah. If you want to form me, I, you know, again, I don't, I don't necessarily need your counsel number, uh, but if you, if you want to forward it to me, absolutely, you can. If you, if you want to reach out, that's fine. Um, I don't. No, I, I don't. I've seen you his name. His name's Alex Tesla. Been my attorney for many years. With, uh, you can give him a call next time. Uh, I usually call him. I didn't really know what this was about. I saw the number. I didn't know. If it prank call or what it was. I get so many calls every day, so I just have to call back. And I, I guess you are the real deal thing. So, but you know, for the record, uh, I don't feel threatened by Mr. Prince. I have no issues with Mr. Prince. Uh, he has no issues with me. Uh, the, the business is being thought out and dealt with through the current attorney and that family. Yes, sir. I completely understand. And and, and Mr. Jones, I, I certainly appreciate you giving me a call back. Okay, no problem. All right, take care. All right. Oh. So, Earl, the only reason why I didn't just hang the phone up, because if I'd have hung the phone up, that's the reason for them to leave the investigation open. So I had the conversation and just killed everything they thought they was on. 